star and welcome to starlight starbright 70. if you are returning thank you so much for coming back and if you're new welcome come on in uh, today i'm going to be reviewing some diamond paintings that i received from timu if you don't know what timu is it's an online marketplace that has thousands of sellers and thousands of products along with diamond paintings um i'm going to leave a link up here on the screen along with my uh, promotion code as well as in my description box below uh, just click on that link it will take you to download the app you have one hour to shop once you go to your checkout just make sure you put my promo code in there and uh, Timu will give you 30% off your first order once that's all processed then you will get a hundred dollar coupon bundle towards your next orders uh, if you haven't downloaded the app within like 14 days, I believe, or if you haven't had the app on your phone for 14 days, you can also, uh, I believe, get that deal. And as well, even if you are a user uh, or you shop at Timu, uh, I believe there's some kind of special deals for you as well. That I'm not positive about, but you can use my link. Uh, or just put my code up in the search bar, my pro promotional code, and uh, see if there's any deals there for you. I do know that um, when I watch other uh, affiliates on on uh, YouTube, because I'm, I'm still new to all this, um, but they do say you can use the link as well. So, so yeah, so I'm just giving you those options if you would like. I also want to say I am truly blessed to all my subscribers now. I, I'm i up to uh, over 90. So getting very close to that 100. And so thank you guys so very much. I so appreciate it. Uh, if you're not subscribed, just go ahead. Go over there. Hit that subscribe button. Uh, ring that bell. I will notify you when I come on. I do diamond painting reviews. I do team haul reviews. Uh, I do. Com I show my completions. So I also got a bunch of videos there. Um, but yeah, you can just go to my channel and check out my other videos. I'd greatly appreciate that. So anyway, so let's get on with this. I'm so excited. These are these are really nice. So the first one I have here is a little deer. She's really cute. Just in the forest. She is. It's quite um, messy looking, I would say. I don't know if it's really messy looking, but as you can see, it does have the flock canvas with the uh, with the sheared edges, which is really nice. It's a very soft canvas. I believe this is the company here. Uh, I, I believe this one was sold out, so what I'll do in my description box is I will put uh, the seller instead of the instead of the deer in there. So you can just go and check out the seller and look at the other diamond paintings they have if you'd like. Uh, this one I paid $8.79. Uh, really clear though for the drill fill. Really, really nice and clear. This one is a square and it does have a B's. Um, it did come with this here, the little sheet, and if you're new to diamond painting, all diamond paintings come with a kit similar to this. Um, so it gives you your little tray to put your diamonds in, gives you wax and a pen, so you basically just dip this pen into the wax, and then you follow the color coded chart that's on the side of the painting. I'll just lift that up for you so you can see that. So these symbols here is what's going to be on the painting. And then they number the symbols. Uh, like I said, this one has 38 numbers. So, And then it does have three ABs, which is uh, special diamonds. They have more of like a sparkle to them. So uh, I'll show you here in a minute what they look like. But yeah, so this is really all that you need to start. I would suggest, though, this this tray isn't the best. It's very flimsy. Um, you can purchase a tray for under two bucks um, on Timu. You just type in diamond trays and it will come up. Uh, for example, I'll show you which one I use. I'm just gonna reach here on my table. So this is the one I use. I it's a perfect size for me. 
So, and you can see that how deep that is. So when you're shaking your diamonds, they're not popping out of the, uh, the tray. So I have a couple of, of these kind that I use. Let's make sure that doesn't fall on the floor and go crash. All right. So, so this one again just shows you the picture and then it just basically has the same thing as a chart except these bags I presume is the weight. It says bags, but um, I'm presuming it's just the weight of the bags. And then it tells you the qua the quantity of your diamonds, so how many diamonds you have in each, uh, or how many diamonds are of each color there. So these are the diamonds, and like I said, I'll open them up. Sorry about the noise. And then one, two, three. Did I say three ABs? Yeah, three ABs. So you got a pretty yellow. If you can see that, really pretty, pretty yellow. And then you got a really pretty. Uh, purple and then pretty and pink they're really really nice hopefully you can see that see if I can spread them out a little bit here you can see the sparkle in them so yeah so this uh, painting I mean it's got a lot of browns in it and grays blues And then blacks, grays, another kind of a darker black, or darker gray, I'll say. Some other grays. Then you got your pinks and your purples in there as well. There's a kind of a peachy color there. So yeah, really, really nice uh, color palette. This is a square, so and the squares actually look quite nice. Yeah, you can see them. They're, they look really, really nice for being a square. They are a smaller, looks like they are a smaller square, but we'll see once we start placing them. I suggest if you are beginning, though, don't start with a square painting. Uh, go round for your very first diamond painting. And either do a 30 by 30 or 30 by 40. Um, just to start off, just to see if you're going to like it. Uh, but like I said, this one cost, did I say how much it was? $8.79. Oops. Hard closing these bags afterwards. <laughs> Messy. I hope everyone had an awesome day today. Me, I worked on my diamond painting again. Trying to get that done. I've got a row and uh, a one and a half to go, I'll say. I, I uh, probably, one, two, three, four. Well, we'll look at it after, but uh, that's basically a row left. By tonight, there will be a row left. Um, but yeah, so look at how sticky this one is. Oh yeah, nice and sticky. I have had these laying under my mattress, so as you can see, they're all nice and flat and ready to go. So I just go under there and just pick one out which one I want to do and off I go. The second one I have here is a beautiful giraffe, just the face of the giraffe. There's going to be tons of color blocking in this one, so it shouldn't take too long. Uh, this one has 36 colors and it has four ABs. It is from that same company. And as you can see, very, very again, nice drill fill there. Really, really nice. And uh, these ones are all mixed up. The uh, They're not in order, but that's okay. I usually put them in order when I uh, put them in containers anyway. So, And then this is some of the colors here. Really 
nice. A lot of black. <laughs> it's going to be filled with mostly black around here. The only thing I'm not sure of is going to be around his mouth here. Because it goes up in here and it's all black. And then it... So I'm not sure how his bottom of his mouth is going to turn out. but And then his ear up here I noticed too. Is it's got all black, but it does have an outline, so maybe it would be okay. Hopefully, hopefully it will be okay. But yeah, very very nice. Again, soft back, and it's got the uh, sheared edges to it. So, really really nice. And these AVs, and this one too came with a little chart inside. I wish these charts had stickers on them, though. It'd be really nice if they would do that. I mean, they just, I think, just print them out and that would be the end of it, you know. But that's what the draft looks like. And then it's basically the same, except for it does have the little bags on the side, which I presume, like I said, are the weight. The weight of the bags. But, so this one had four ABs. Here's one, two of them. I said lots of black. There's another one. Oh, perfect. There's the other one. So you got purple. Maybe I'll show this side instead of the sticker. The sticker side. <laughs> then you have white. Hope you can see that there's not too much of a of a shadow there. And a nice blue. And then a, a reddish color, I guess. You would call that red. So yeah, really nice. And like I said, a lot of darks. It's a whole bag here of just three tens. So they are all squares. The squares do look Fairly nice. I don't see really anything too bad about them. But yeah, so a lot of grays, some greens, some beiges, and then another whole bag of black. <laughs> so yeah, this will be a dark one. So if you have problems seeing the dark colors, then uh, this or this painting might be a little bit difficult for you to do. Um, I do use a light pad as it's sitting right here, as you can see, uh, for most of my paintings that I do. So, but I think this one won't be too too bad. I think it, will, it might turn out really nice. I do really like the different colors that it has in there. In the draft, it is quite pretty. Sorry for the crinkling, guys. So that's the next one. So, yeah, we'll check the stickiness of this one. And then the cost of this one was $9.19, I believe, and um, unfortunately it is sold out so again I can it is the same seller as the other one so I will just put the seller in the description for you guys if you're interested in just checking out what they have because I mean it is really nice uh, canvas and it's not even that expensive these were 40 these are 45 by 55 and uh, both of them were under ten dollars so and they got a B's in them which is really really nice so the next one is this giraffe here. It is a 40 by 70 and just really, really colorful. I mean, again, it's got a bit of a darker background as you can see, um, but this, these colors are just gorgeous. It almost makes it look like this giraffe is uh, on fire a little bit. It's kind of got a glow, like a glowing fire around it. I just thought it was really neat. So I love giraffes. 
I know I told this story before, but a couple years back, there was a giraffe in Animal Adventure, Animal Adventures, I think. It was all over YouTube. And uh, April was her name, and she was having a baby. And I watched that for hours. I don't know how many hours I spent watching that giraffe walk around. But uh, anyway, I was fortunate enough to actually watch the birth. Um, I think it happened like really early in the morning. But this one has 24 colors. And it is all nicely 1 through 9. And then all the letters. So really, really nice. Drill fill looks really, really nice. No issues there at all. So, right on. And then these ones come up kitted in their own, or it's already kitted, so they're all in their own little baggies already. And uh, and I don't believe this one had any special any special drills to it or diamonds. So really, really nice. So you got the oranges and the yellows. Really nice blues in there. A lot of blacks. <laughs> so again, if you have issues with uh, dark paintings, this might not be a painting for you. But I don't seem to have an issue as long as I use a light pad. And yeah, and the stickiness on this one is... Let's see. Oh, yeah, it's pretty good. Not as good as the other ones. So I'm going to give it about an 8 out of 10. <laughs> but it will be no problem sticking these uh, diamonds on them. This one is a round. So. But yeah. And this one was uh, 10 for... Oh uh, no. Sorry. This one was 11.48. It is sold out right now. So again, I can put the uh, seller on the... Um, on the description for you guys if you want to go check the seller out but like I said it's really nice when they come kitted up already and uh, I really like that so we might as well finish with my last giraffe and yeah, my husband was on a kick <laughs> again this one comes kitted up which is nice I like when that happens And this one is weird. It has, um, I don't know if you can see that, but it has all this extra film for the covering of the painting. I guess they must have run out, and so they just added a piece. <laughs> but that's all right. We'll see how sticky this one is. Oh, yeah, this one's nice and sticky. Pretty good. Uh, this one has 24 colors, and again, you can see one through eight, and then A down to W. So very nice, nicely clear too. The drill fill on this is awesome. So as you can see, it's just the mother and a baby. So uh, the mother's name was April, and the baby's Taj. So. This is April and Taj. <laughs> um, but the, of course, out, this will be out in the uh, safari uh, desert somewhere. But, but yeah, really, really nice. I think these, these all these uh, patterns are going to turn out really nice. And you have a really nice pinkish background to it. A lot of color blocking in this one. So it shouldn't take as long. Uh, confetti usually takes a lot longer to complete. So this one will probably go pretty fast once I start it. Um, but yeah, these are the diamonds. Beautiful colors. Absolutely gorgeous colors. If you can all see that. Really, really nice colors. I don't think there's any special jewels in this one. Just all diamonds. And uh, and round. They're all round. So yeah, I think that one. Like I said, I think the uh, pattern of the drafts on that will be really nice. And 
And then my last one to show you guys is a picture of the desert. I just fell in love with this it, uh, when I saw it. Um, it's got your cactuses and then it's got a sunset. Uh, basically the blue sky here still and the sun is setting. Kind of like how it looks like in the desert. <laughs> so it's like, oh, it's so pretty. I don't know how much, yeah, hopefully you can get most of it here in the camera. But yeah, a lot of confetti down here and then there's going to be a lot of uh, color blocking up here. So, kind of reminds me of that horse that I completed. If you uh, go watch, um, there's a video I put out for the largest size paintings that I did. And uh, it was basically just a picture of a horse, but down below was a lot of the confetti and then on top it was just a lot of uh, color blocking but this one has one through eight and then a to u so really really nice and like i said uh, these ones don't come kitted up so you have to buy containers for these ones to put your diamonds in or you can cut them and then fold them over and tape them but but it's just too easy to lose diamonds that way uh, so I do suggest to buy a uh, containers for your diamonds if your diamonds come this way but these are the colors absolutely just gorgeous colors I got a blue just a beautiful blue and the orange so yeah, this one's going to be really nice when it's done. We'll go with my little desert theme. Maybe I'll work on this one beginning of next month and get it done. We'll see how how I am by the end of uh, March here. I have like a couple paintings I want to get done for before Easter. But, but anyway, really, really nice. The stickiness of this one is really sticky that's a 10 out of 10 right there really nice and sticky and like i said i've been just keeping these under my mattresses so under my mattress and uh so it's nicely flat ready to go and i just want to show you the progress of my current um diamond painting that i'm working on the rabbit is now almost complete. As you can see, really, really nice sparkle to this one. Um, this one is a square. And this is the one that uh, I'll be giving away for my 100 uh, sub. Once I reach 100. I think I'll probably reach 100 uh, before... Uh, I've even done this painting, but this is the one I plan on giving away. And if you are a diamond painter, then I'm thinking, uh, I was talking to my husband and uh, we were thinking of, I could probably order this painting as long as it's still available um, on Timu for you and then just get it sent to you. Uh, I know other uh uh, people on YouTube that I watch, they do collabs where they send each other packages to open. So I'm sure that's a thing and I'll, I'll for sure figure that out. Um, or we could figure something out, I'm sure. So yeah. Really, really pretty. Um, I'm also doing, the reason why I started this one was because of, uh, Diamond Grandma and um, Diamond Diamonds with Tita. I hope I got that right. I probably keep saying it wrong. I'm going to put their links in my description. But they have two events. Uh, Diamond Grandma has one and Tita has one. So Diamond Grandma is all petals. And they both have Facebook pages. So I do suggest that you go uh, to their channels maybe hit their subscribe I'm sure they would love it if you're not already subscribed to them <laughs> and if you do diamond paint um, and enter their events diamond grandma has one every month and I believe Tita has one every month so, so yeah so that's 
what I uh, started this one for, but because I think it's it's uh, turning out so lovely, I thought, oh, this would be a good giveaway for my 100 sub. I just feel so blessed uh, that uh, I even got to, or, or I'm getting to 100 subs. Um, just an incredible feeling. Uh, I've just loved to see my channel grow the way it's growing and I hope to continue and I should say God willing I will continue <laughs> I, I am enjoying it and uh, I just again thank you so much um, and then I just want to leave you with this little uh, Winnie the Pooh saying is uh, you are braver than you believe you are stronger than you seem smarter than you think and many blessings from my house to yours. Uh, God's richest blessings. Bye.